So guys, welcome again to my world. My name is Lin Zabu. If it's your first time to see me. Today, I'm visiting Sarah Tadun, the prominent urban farmer. Yeah? <laughs> and we are at her house today. So I've finished eating the berries. Now I am on the sugar cane. We are going to be looking at how to make your home not just beautiful, but also healthy, especially if you have kids, and also how to make money from your small space if you're in Kampala. Most of you are thinking that she's in, uh, in the village, eh? No, she's here, 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 in our Kampala here. And she's making the environment very beautiful. Don't mind about this, this eh? Even the Bible says you shall eat from your what? From your sweat. So today, allow me to take you through her gardening journey, how she maintains the place, and how she makes. Do you make money out of this? Yeah, if you want to. So, just join the video, give it a thumbs up, giving it, uh, give it a like, and uh, let's enjoy. Don't come on the sugar cane. You are not invited. <laughs> So finally, I meet Sarah. Lynn, I've known you forever. Ah, uh, like forever. You need to give me tips on how to be smaller, cylinder, and model. <laughs> <laughs> and yet, you're my inspiration. I also uh, want to be delicious and yeah. what. My weight, I complain my about my weight every day, and I do nothing about it. You're okay. That's why you're not doing anything about it because you're okay. Let's meet you, sir. I am so happy to have you. Oh. So happy. Remember when we were talking on the phone? I was like, Lynn, I need to come see you. I have this for you, but like you can see, Kampala sun is so hot. Kampala sun is making me sweat. Eh? I, I think know. now I have like four colors. Each part of my body has a different <laughs> color. But nice to meet you. I can't wait for you to show. Will you do us the favor, yeah. the honor of showing us around your garden? So, Lynn, here okay. mm -hmm. we have raised beds. Yeah. We have, um, these are the raised beds. Yeah. Made from iron sheets. Mm -hmm. So, when you have your leftovers, you could do this. Mm -hmm. These are made from iron sheets. Mm -hmm. This is a uh, cauliflower. This looks like Skumawiki. Uh, yeah, but it's cauliflower. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which one? So this is cauliflower. Yeah. And some fennel. I have actually better fennel there. This morning when you called, I was working on this bed with Viani. Yeah. So we refilled here and I pruned the tomatoes. These tomatoes, I don't know which type exactly, but you can you can check here. I'm very sure you're not yet seen. No. Maybe the other side. The other side is so hot. This looks very nice. Okay, but there's a tomato here. Can you see? This one. Oh, yeah. Let's check it. Oh, okay. Yeah. And this is, I planted from a cutting. Mm, a cutting? What yes. do you mean? Um, I'm trying to look like I planted this as a plant down the other side mm -hmm. and it was dying. Then? So I was like, before it dies, let me cut and plant others, like this. Oh, this is what I planted. Really? Yes. How so did I, you plant it? I just got this and stuck in the soil and watered. Cut in the soil and then watered. So you can plant tomatoes from cuttings as well. Guys, I only thought that tomatoes can only be gotten from a bedding or when they have roots down i'm surprised yeah that is so interesting all these this bud this new one mm. you can cut and, and put in your soil wow you should try that actually. wow this feels like a village but we are in the middle of kampala <laughs> so, this is fennel yeah i have been cutting down so that they don't flower they don't mm. bolt oh okay because when the flower, it's done. What is fennel used for? Fennel, you can use it in juice. Mm -hmm. But uh, I don't like the taste so much. Yeah. But the rabbits do love it. Oh, so it's more for the rabbits. For the rabbits and for the pollinators. The flowers are very beautiful. Hmm. Hopefully you come back and see when it flowers. I promise I will if you invite me. Yeah. So <laughs> when you see, mm -hmm. if you don't have space, yeah. in such a small space just as this, we have fennel, we have uh, pepper, 
some more tomatoes. These are yellow. Very lovely tomatoes. Let me take a see some. More. I can see the little ones. Yeah. yeah. So you can plant different things in one bed. Mm, in that mm. if, if an insect attacks the other one, it may not attack. Maybe it doesn't like the, the smell of dill or fennel. Hmm. And here I have my bell pepper, the yellow bell pepper. Oh my god, looks healthy and big. Yeah. You can also eat them when they're still green. Oh, like but, green pepper? Yeah, but I love it when it's like this. Oh, okay. Yeah. But that's something I've never tried to eat. Though I see it in supermarkets, but I've never bothered to. It's quite expensive. <laughs> yeah. It's quite expensive. And it's just sweet. It's a bit sweet. Mm -hmm. yeah. Here I have garden egg. Yeah. The white entula. The white entula eggplants. Garden and eggs. Garden eggs. Yeah. Oh, so the the green ones are called eggplants, and no, then egg, the I white ones. Plants. I have eggplants here. Are called garden entula. <laughs> <This one. laughs> oh, those are the eggplants. Yeah, also known as aubergine. Ob eh. Aubergine. So these are aubergine. Eggplants. Yeah. Uh, when I was working in a restaurant. We used to call that aubergine. Yes. Aubergine. <laughs> aubergine. So yeah. that is the eggplant. This is garden eggs. The white entula. There's mm, white and green. Yes. Yeah. I love them. And this is cucumber. The one that, that is growing. is dry. Yeah, this is cucumber. The sun is just too much. Too much sun. Mm. Yeah. And then this is just a nitrogen fixing plant yeah it's like a bean but to me it is like a full plant i'll show you the one that has a fruit the other side okay and then my cassava so Ooh. i don't know where they are reaching taller than the farmer <laughs> over here i have uh, green beans yeah French beans. yeah so i have harvested a lot from here and this i want them to go to seed so i have left have them to, to grow Oh, Once the rain season starts. yay! Yeah, so there's green beans, and these are the ones that I planted from cutting the, the tomatoes. See, this one is it looks like it's alive. Mm. This one is still shocked, but it will come up oh, from okay. this from the cutting. That's how you multiply your tomatoes, guys. Who told you that farming is only for the village and that it should be complicated and that you should be that? No, 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 no. Uh, Sarah Pedun is proving to me that farming is fun, it is interesting. I've been at her place for a few minutes now and I don't want to go back to my own house because the oxygen here is different. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so extra. No, I'm not extra. I swear it's been different. So this what is, is this? Cabbage. Oh. I also okay. had many, but mm. I left this. I thought it would flower. It's forming the cabbage now. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. So it's one of those very long cabbages. Oh. Yeah. I only see them in supermarkets. Where do you get all these ideas? I I, I watch a lot of YouTube. I borrow ideas from YouTube and I just like to try out uh, things as well. So in this garden, this is a mistake, clean. Yeah. I planted this thinking it was cucumber. Hmm. But they are cucumbers. Cucumbers. Yeah. What are cucumbers? Are yeah. they like uh, wild, wild yes. cucumbers? Um, we could call them wild cucumbers. <laughs> you see, they oh. don't grow so big. Oh, but these they're... are for the wild. Yeah. They be in the forests. Yeah. So it's taking over the bed. Mm. And then I have a watermelon that is climbing. Oh, it's going all the way there. So my, I just intend to leave watermelon. Mm. And this is radish. Rad what is radish sorry, sorry. for? The cucumbers are a bit. Yeah. Radish, you can use it in your salads. Mm. It's like a watery carrot, mm. but spicy. A bit spicy. Why are you pulling it out you though? Was it. it ready? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I don't know. Do you fear the soil? You try a little bit. No. You shall wash and you try it. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, we'll wash this one. They're all done. They're all ready. Let me hold for you so you, you show us the tour properly. You don't say, oh, I was carrying things. <laughs> so here we have the cucumbers, yes. the watermelon, uh -huh. and the radish. Wow. This and is the... That is the easiest thing to grow in. This one? Very easy to grow. It's not fussy. It will, it will grow and you have lots of it. 
Really? Yeah, I have more than I can eat, so I share with the rabbits. The rabbits oh, love the leaves. Oh, the leaves. Yeah. Okay. And then we have this other one. In this bed. Yeah. This is spinach. It's palak spinach. Yeah. Or Indian spinach. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. <laughs> this is very delicious. We have harvested it very many times. And like I told you, mm -hmm. uh, most times when I have things, I let them go to seed. Mm -hmm. I let them flower and... I collect seeds for next season. Yay. So as you can see this one, it's bolting. Bolting means it's starting to flower. Oh. Yeah, so I'll just let this be. It will be a beautiful flower and after that seeds. Wow. But you can still enjoy these leaves, they're, they're fresh. I see these things in supermarkets and now I'm seeing them first hand. And this with my one, eyes. I always take them for the chickens. Oh. Wow. Aline, this is something interesting. Let me see. I'm up this. for anything interesting. What this, is that? This is nasturtiums. They are very beautiful flowers. Mm -hmm. They have bright yellow, orange, mm -hmm. red, mm -hmm. and every part is edible. You can eat the leaf, you can eat the flower, you can eat the seed. Okay. I can't wait to show you when it's, <laughs> when it's all yeah. showing off. So it's going to go up here Clem. those are beans yeah these are called christmas lima beans christmas lima beans yeah i just discovered the name i didn't know that <laughs> and i've had them like for two years <laughs> christmas uh, lima beans those yes. those beans used to be very famous in our villages no. they used to be very famous yeah. so i use it for a, like a curtain so oh oh natural curtains yes, yes. <laughs> so that's why i have it here <laughs> But this nasturtium is mm. going to grow and it is going to go all the way there. Oh, okay. And by then I'll have to call you and say, Lynn, come hey, have come, a look. Come, we have a look. Guys, I've been wanting to show you some plants and to give you the names. But then I don't know the, the scientific names. I'd be saying, I don't know the scientific names. <laughs> but Sarah here name. knows every name. What we have here? And I'm sweating, yo. So this one. Mm. I wanted to make for the kids a tipi. Yeah. This is their garden. Okay. Uh, they planted this. These are these are string beans. Okay. And I've decided to name this this tipi Namugongo. As you know, we are. Oh the yes, Namugongo the shrine. shrine. Yeah. So they put a bucket over it oh. to make it look like the shrine. Oh. And it's going to be like a natural tent. So the beans here are going to crawl up. Okay. And they play inside. Right. Yeah. So this is for the kids. Your kids are very lucky. They, they are going to have everything organic. Guys, if you see me sweating, that's because of you. <laughs> yeah, it's very hot and it's because of you. I know you'll be asking, where is the next video? <laughs> so what is that, sir? These are strawberries. Some of them are quite shocked because I moved this from there. That bed is new. Oh. So I moved, I moved this line and brought them here. Okay. These are strawberries. I grew them like this so it's easy to pick. Like the kids, no, I don't spray. I don't spray the garden. Yeah. So once they're ready, they just pick and eat. You don't really have to wash. You have to wash, but... African jams are not aware. Exactly. <laughs> also, you see, I don't have space. In How long did it take for you to have these? So to, this... to make these? Because they look quite... This, this one, I just put it yesterday. This is just a pipe with mm. cutting. But you see, if you always have plants around, mm. once you get the idea or get the material, yeah. you just move your plant to here. Oh. I have very many strawberries in the containers there. Mm. So these are the, the new ones, the runners that I put here. Mm. And I didn't quite well. Right. So this is what I'm saying. Even if you have a small space, yeah. you can grow like this. You grow vertically. Mm. You can either do this or this, a smaller one. Yeah. And I have beans for you, this thing beans for you. Yes, 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 yes. You should see my teeth, they're all up. Look at this tire. Oh my god. These are coleus. Yeah. And this is um, pineapple mint. I just put it there. Pineapple mint. Yeah, this is. I'm hearing names, I, I have no idea what they this, mean. This is syngonium. Yes, as you see, but there's a lot of green going on. Yeah. So I just put this to give some. some bit of color yeah mums mums those flowers. the flowers yeah. i see them in rich people's weddings videos eh? now they're going to be in brooklyn <laughs> <place. laughs> 
Yeah. Once it starts raining, I'm going to send you this flower. Did you hear that in Rich Lynn's house? <laughs> so Lynn, yes. I bought this plant and the person was like, oh, you need cut, you need a root hormone to multiply them. Hmm. But then I just do this. I just cut it like this mm -hmm. and then plant and it grows really? without any root hormone. In the soil? Yes. This is why I have very many. If you see the other side, I have very many mums. Oh. This is what I keep doing. Okay. I just get it like this and stick in the soil. Wow. So this one, I'll cut it down mm -hmm. and then it will sprout again. Wow. Yeah. And this, I am so proud of this. <laughs> mm -hmm. So this is a, a garden chandelier. Mm -hmm. It has my, it has all the mints that I have in the garden. So when the wind is blowing, you can see it moves like that. When the wind is blowing, now well, just push it right now. So I have here pineapple mint, spearmint, uh, and what? Oh, there's just so what many. I have oregano. Yes, it's just a tiny bed. I have all this in, in the other beds, but I just love to look at it when I'm sitting here. Hmm. Yeah. I like I it. Guess, yeah. <laughs> just, just like this. Oh one. my god. Mm -hmm. It's so just this, so much happening in one space this, and it's all healthy and beautiful. This is perfect for, mm. for like you for your windowsill. Yeah. We shall do this for your 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 kitchen once it's done. Okay. So it's self-watering even when you leave when you go to Fort Porto or mm. wherever. Mm -hmm. You just fill here with water. Yeah. And do this and let it be. And it will thrive. Wow. Yeah, so. so this is another type of garden, but this can be on your windowsill, in your kitchen windowsill. I'm just so speechless. I don't I don't even have other questions to ask you. So how long did it take for you to make this? This it's a day. A day? Yeah. I wait not not a full day, mm. but you know. Just a few hours. Yes. <laughs> I got this this bottles from some guys playing football mm. i asked them if i could have it mm. and they gave me mm. and then i just got this shoe string ah. and this is from my detergent from my detergent detergent container yeah and made this so it, it all it costed nothing these are all recycled guys and you'll be there you are like we don't have jobsy we don't have jobsy do like this one and you see how people come buying chandelier garden chandeliers from you yeah i am just impressed by the amount of plants that are here so i have a viani he's mm. very he's very curious about gardening too yeah so this is i think one is butternut squash and the other one is just ordinary pumpkin oh, yeah and this is this is also the cutting i took yeah around. yeah See, like I told so you, why have you pulled it out it was still, i was just showing oh so that's shocking so this too much. is going to climb here oh the pumpkin. And this tree will be a pumpkin tree. Okay. Hopefully Lynn will come and feed that. <laughs> no, I'll be stalking her. By the way, she does have a YouTube channel called... Sarah Pedun. Kindly check me out. She has a very interesting channel called Sarah Pedun. And she posts content to do with farming, of course. And many of you, including some of her subscribers, think she's living deep in the village. No! We are here, 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 right in Kampala, here. Eh? So go please and check her out. And what is this? What do we got here? That has rabbits. Oh, it's the rabbit house. Yeah. We can leave them. Don't, okay. don't disturb them. Leave the rabbits alone. <laughs> Behave yourself. I've never held a thing this small. It's like a rat. <laughs> they actually look like rats when they're little. It's like a rat. But they're so cute. <laughs> hey, now this is, you see the trick to feeding. Hey, but madam, feed when your legs are wide open <laughs> so the babies can eat. Whoa, you have a lot. It's like, do you sell some of these? Um, not really, but I give out like, I, you know, I promise to lots of plants. Yeah. <laughs> so today you have to plant two. <laughs> to be like, I want that. Yes, yes, yes. This is called croton. This is that big tree. 
Oh, which one? This, this one? Yeah, this, there are very many. These. Oh. These ones, the, the, the ones that are so many here. These ones. So I wanted, I wanted a tree in my house, another tree, but I think we are going to get from Sarah Pedun. We are going to Absolutely. Sarah's green supermarket. Yes. <laughs> you are allowed to shop. You have loads of shop. Oh my God, they're so Whatever beautiful. And the purple. The yeah, purple. This purple mm. is so mean. It only gave me one fruit. Don't worry. Even my pumpkins gave me one fruit. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> and then what is this, Sarah? This is called African sweet basil. African sweet basil. Yeah, omujaja. Omuja. <laughs> but this is the purple. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm embarrassed. You said what? This? African sweet basil. Omujaja muluzugu. <laughs> but Luganda is not my language. <laughs> oh God. Yeah. Uh huh. So this is this is the purple one. Yeah. It's perfect for pollinators. Are you seeing the bees? Are you seeing oh, whatever is going on here? Yes. Yeah, and also it smells so good. Yeah. Do you the drink purple. it? Oh, um, it's just for the... I just love the beauty. And yeah. also for my pollinators. Are you seeing the bees, Lynn? Yeah, I can see yeah. the bees, but they're very small. The, yes. My camera may not be able yes, to... So the bees, butterflies, they love it. Oh, okay. Yeah, then we have guava. We have apple. This is apple from seed. Yeah. This is an apple tree. Yeah. Will it actually make fruits, you yeah. think? Well, in five years, it may not be the normal big apples you see from the supermarket. Five years? Yeah, they say when you plant from seed, a tree takes five to seven years to fruit. Yeah. Yeah. Even this is mango from, from seed. Wow. So, these are strawberries. You can see some wow. flowers. We have strawberries here. And this Am I allowed to eat any? This, yeah. a, this, this is a mulberry, just a short mulberry. So but it's I'm not going sweet. To eat it. Okay, you can try that one. It's supposed to be black. Mm. That's a bit. It's not sweet. It's a yeah. bit bitter. Yeah. This one is a pigeon peas. Mm -hmm. Actually, in in our area in the east, we do eat this. Yeah. Yeah. Even and in Fort, we eat them. Okay. Mm. But so now they are very. Dry. But now they are not common, they are yeah. a bit rare now. You see, that's why I love indigenous things. I love to have local things around. Mm. Um, should we go down the, this? This, you know this? Yeah. This the problem, guys, there is so much to see. That's true. There is a lot to see. These are gooseberries. Gooseberries. Yeah, some people call them ground berries because when they fall, you pick them from Gooseberries. God, I'm learning so much. I must pay tuition. Or ground berries. <laughs> because you wait for them to fall. Yeah. The okay. Ground. Right. This is your mulberry. Mm -hmm. Purple and matoke. You've seen my matoke. Yeah, it looks very healthy. Mine is kind of, I don't know, there's a way it's growing that I don't like. Yeah, and my sweet banana. Yeah, <laughs> it's ready. We're about to have this. Sarah, it's ready. This one was ready for me. <laughs> I, can, I think it's ready. I don't know how to tell. It's ready. Yeah, and then we have gone. But we go up. Yeah. But mm. you you can actually, um, if you want to, guys. I'm sorry. I'm uh, using my hands to clear. In Africa, uh, things yeah. are easy like that. Eh? But that's like <laughs> not complicated. Uh, so, what was I going to say? Uh, the sweet banana. The sweet banana. If you want. You can actually leave it like that until it starts showing you yellow stuff. Mm -hmm. You know? Look, we have avocado. Whee! But this one is not ready. And you are not tall enough to jump for those. Yeah, but this one is almost... It's this ready. one is almost... Is <laughs> no, I'll not. It will be bad for me to waste them just like that. So, yeah, Simply because I want... But it's going to be loaded with food. Yes, yeah. it's already it's already loading with fruits. Yeah, so that's why when I see people having homes with nothing green, there's a way I feel like you don't live life. Eh? <laughs> so, <laughs> you have to wait after two years. Two years, Lynn. What? This is plantain, very sweet. So you're saying that has taken you two years to grow. <laughs> so 
good years. Yeah, you are patient. This one can test your patience. <laughs> hey, Ina, did you know that that is a male banana? Oh, no. In the banana kingdom, in banana plantation kingdom, yes. that one is considered the male banana. Gonja. Yes. Okay, that one is something I've just <laughs> Yes. I have just learned that. Mm, it's I, I guess that's why it takes long to grow no and wonder. and it is very expensive also. Yes. Mm. Uh-huh. Yeah, marigold. I should get for you some you can't Mary me. yes, mm. definitely. Marigold. Marigold. Yes. It's like marigold. Marigold. Yes. Okay. And you have a lot of pumpkins. Oh yeah. The other side. This this these are seedlings. Mm. One side is butternut squash, one uh -huh. side is the normal pumpkin, but I don't know which which they is They look the same. Yeah. Wow. So we'll transplant them from here. When do you eat these cassavas? Because you have a lot. We actually, these, these ones are not yet matured. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but when they Texas, are... Yeah. Yes, they're about, I don't know how many months. You know these were the flowers we used to have long time in ago the in the villages but now they are very you, you barely see them you, you really barely see them. them now but you know you can also take it as tea you tea dry them, yeah really you dry this and take it as your tea really yeah i'm learning so much huh so just like i've learned today i didn't know <laughs> <laughs> that was a male flower. Hey, it is. So this, this one you just going to throw there. Whether it's hot, you'll just be pouring some water. Okay. I need and this leaf to put these seeds here. Good. Okay. See, no so need for polythene bags. bags. <laughs> no. This, this is, I think, a weed. But it looks like a zinnia. It's a flower as it's well. A beautiful flower. Hmm. Behind Nakawa. This is where I got this from. I like the way this smells. It, it's like it sends away some bad energies, yeah. I guess. So uh -huh. This one, I was on a border and I told the border, I like those flowers I need to get. Hey. And he's like, but that is just a weed. I was like, well, you just escort me up there. I was embarrassed <laughs> to go and pick the dry ones. So I went with him and I, and I picked them and now I have lots of them. Oh, they look nice. Yeah. You should keep for me some seed. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I need some pepper. I so I grind them and give my chicken. They say actually, it's good for the chicken. Yeah, we should we'll have should we have some of this? Yeah. But the red ones would be nice. Okay, then we'll I don't know if I have red ones inside there. We shall check, don't worry. Yeah, and then this is this is also bell pepper, small one. Uh -huh. The green pepper. Uh-huh. This you should have in your compound lean. They're very small. What do they do? They, you eat them like green pepper. Oh. But they grow very fast. Aha. Uh -huh. The red one is here. They grow very fast. Uh -huh. Same with this. This one you should just throw one in your compound. Mm. And then it will grow. Yeah. Oh God. This has got to be one of the healthiest homes that I've visited in Kampala so far. So you have no excuse literally for not having you know your space may not be as big as sarah's or as big as mine but plant something yeah. eh? plant something that's why we are having droughts now yes he, he, don't break it like that you've broken my heart Lynn, look, we have, yeah, we have there, you yes have there, you yes want. still don't yeah. break it like that you break my heart I know. my butternut squash but it's not doing well uh, Maybe because of the weather the weather is too much yeah. mm-hmm um, what is this comfrey comfrey yeah it's just for making the soil good I'm so happy you have you know a lot of uh, scientific names that I don't. Yeah, I'm crying. I'm crying. <laughs> so let's go and see that. No, there's another bed there. Oh, okay. So I mean, this looks like the road to heaven. <laughs> My husband is driving here. He has a pickup. Sometimes the plants do cover like there. Yeah. He's like, these plants. <laughs> This looks like the road to heaven. It's beautiful. It's coming. I think this is what I can call. Aha! Come, I show you. This, you know this grass. How is it called? I don't know. I just know it's a weed. Yeah, okay. Now this grass here. Mm. When we were growing up, our parents used to tell. It's called kayayana locally. Hmm. Kayayana. Uh -huh. 
So the ladies were advised to wash themselves with this. Ah. Yeah, like when you're going to take a bath, basically you just pick okay. these leaves, mm. you how do you squash call them? you scratch or squeeze them, mm. yes, like that, and then you put into the water and then it's for good luck. Ah. That's what they say. You even have this one, it's here. Same. Is, is it the same thing? Yes, it's the same thing. You mind about the flowers? Okay, they then look I'm, like I'm this. just going to leave them. <laughs> I weed, I'll take, you know. It's a weed, but a good weed, oh, okay. according to the Baganda people. You have to show them this. Ah, you love this. I love it too. It's very beautiful. Please, camera, be fair. Let's see. Okay, I can see it now. Yeah, that's custard apple. Custard apple, is it for eating? Yeah, also? Very sweet. It's really? custard apple or sugar apple. As the sugar. Name says, yeah, oh, sugar apple. okay. It's very sweet. Right. Very sweet. This is calendula. But it has dried. I can put, I'm going to put for you this head. What does it's this a do? This yellow flower. Oh, okay. Yes. You add. I'll just throw them somewhere. Yes. But I might have to keep them until it's rainy season. Yeah. 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 It will easily seed. Hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Lavender. What does lavender do? Lavender, you know the flowers from lavender is used for, for making perfumes, most perfumes. Oh really? Yeah. Then but I'll need it. Lavender itself really smells so good. If you brush your pussy and brush it, mm -hmm. it smells beautiful. Ooh. It smells lovely. Yeah, it does. Yeah. So here we have rosemary. Ah. You can see I'm this this I'm this this of... lavender is almost smelling like my black opium. Oh. Mm. Okay. So this this uh, my fruit trees. This is sour soap. Mm -hmm. This is just. I like palm. sour soap. Yeah. I think I should and take I one. Oh my granite. You're okay to take one. Oh my I'm god. The wash is so kind. Yeah, so take take. Is <laughs> no, guys. You know I can't take any fruits today unfortunately why yeah. because it is so it's, hot it's nowadays and honestly speaking i am up and about you know i'm a full-time content creator so i move a lot and they will die so i need to take these things when there is rain or when i have some helper to water them for me yeah but today you're allowed to just shop just yeah window day, shopping <laughs> so here i have rosemary I have yes oil. Yes. I have, the mint. I, have, I have four types of mint. Oh my god. I have a pineapple mint. Let me smell the pineapple mint. It's not very strong. Mm -hmm. It must have a smell though. Yeah. Ah. This is my favorite. That's pure mint. God. Ah. No, you keep this one. And then peppermint. I want this. Really? Yeah. I want to faint. Because it's <laughs> Then mint. we have peppermint. I have peppermint. We at have home. chocolate mint. Ah, oh, jeez. It's just so much. This and that are not the same? No, they're not. You, do you see the. Do you see this? Oh, God. It's purple. And then the other one is green. Jesus Christ. Like. But you can see it's so hot. Ah. Really? Have you seen my black. The only black tomato I have now? Ah. Blackish. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, one has just fallen. This one is even bad. Oh, sorry. But there's this one. Maybe I should remove it. No, you have already. Yeah. You you eat them? Yeah. These okay. Are cherry tomatoes. We have some pepper, and we have lots of ground berries. My goodness, this is yeah, like look, a whole village. Maybe we should check some of. This is coriander. Coriander. Coriander, and we have some dry ones. Okay, mix. Just put whatever yeah. you see seeds. Just mix there. I will, I will Coriander. have to plant them. Yeah, you plant. It's a beautiful ah. herb. God, I want to belong here so bad. You this so extra. this so extra. Ah. So smells this, good. This is, remember, the plant only is good for fixing nitrogen. Yeah. Oh yes, we used to plant that in the in the village for snakes. They oh, say really? that where there is that plant, snakes don't cross. From I don't know how true that is. Look, it looks like a tree. Yeah, it's just beans. Some people eat them. Really? Mm. Oh, lean. 
You should come and teach me more things. Look at my mango. Look at the it mango. It looks so healthy. Oh my God! It is short, but it is. It's on the in the other plant. Jesus. Yeah. Why? And then there's one also there in the sack. Oh my God! And it has three fruits. Eh? eh? I'm it's stealing it's one. In this sack. Oh my. <laughs> so this is where I start my seed. This is okra. I think um, you should be you should be making millions of money right now <laughs> from selling just uh, what do you call this one? This is dragon fruit. Dragon fruit. Yeah. Right. Dragon fruit. I can't wait to. You know, like this one of fruit, just one, it's mm -hmm. like twenty thousand. Twenty thousand shillings. Yes. Wow. That's expensive. I sh oh, they are the red ones. Yes. Where do you get the seed so I can Look get one? one? Uh oh. It's a snail. Yes, I throw there. <coughs> so it will, the sun will touch it. Why? But it adds to the echo. No, no, no. Okay, it does, but destroys all your plants. Really? Yeah. So That's sad. a lovely entrance. Ah. So here we stand in a secret place. <laughs> okay, just coming into the country. Lots of mountains. Good. So Beautiful. Oh. Lots of matoke. Yeah. yeah. Lynn, this is the plant that I say for the outside containers by the by the entrance. Oh yeah. Yes. They look beautiful. There. Yes, and they look healthy. Yeah. And uh, they have different colors. This one, the sun has really tortured it, so it doesn't look. Oh. Lockwards. You what? also have one in the container. What are lockwards? Lockwards are in Sally. Kensari. Oh, okay. What, what did you say that is? A composting sheet. Oh, okay. You see, we tried to take away the plastic. Yesterday I was in here. Oh. So now I'm trying to dig out for the good soil. Okay. Yeah. Right. So we put the, the leaves and all the cuttings here. Uh -huh. When they get rotten, we take them to the garden. Wow. Meanwhile, I'm still stuck with the rosemary with the mint in my hands because ah, then I have to smear my face like this they say it heals headache I don't know how true that is but I'll, I'll put not that I have headache eh, to prevent future headache <laughs> oh <my> God. <laughs> guys tell me this is not heaven like this has got to be how long have you been here though? Five years. For all this to look this nice. I don't know for all this, but I've been here five years and we, I did not start in those five years. Oh, okay. Yeah. So in the five years you are like, oh, let's see what um, to do. Yeah. You this have seen fun. what I love. This uh -huh. is star fruit. Star fruit. Star. Star like root. Star. Like a star fruit. Star fruit. Yes. I planted from seed. I ate it. I don't like it so much. But, uh, well, how does the star fruit look like? Um, we, we shall Google the, the picture and see. <laughs> okay. It doesn't look like a star fruit until you cut it. Oh, then you get the shape of the star. Okay. Yeah. But uh, to me, this variety was not very tasty, but mm. I love plants. Okay. So you brown. just added them. Yeah. Oh yeah, my god. Pomegranate. Pomegranate! And it's big! We have we have two fruits, one is the other side. Yeah, I'm taking that one too. This one is in the container. <laughs> but I have a, a, the one I have also for you. But eh, you that one, one is yours. If you want this eh. one, you can do it too. But it's too big, it's a bit trendy. Yeah, but and that one is yours. It has a hard passion fruit. This one we bought from. Oh my god. Do you know how much I love these? Do I you love have them. any? Um, no, maybe maybe they're falling up there. Do you know how bad I love these? But, I love uh, them. I planted this from seed. We bought Which from Nitiana. The passion fruit. You really? We bought from Nitiana and I, I planted some. Wow. That we have sugar. And the sugar cane is ready. And you're not eating it. Sweet. Why? Today we eat one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You know, I keep forgetting. I'm like, okay, it's ready for our best thing. <laughs> 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 ah. So, guys, 
we have been having a tour of an urban garden or a home garden call it like that most of you assume that she's in the village no she's actually here in Kampala and I've learned so much from her especially their scientific names Bejun, <laughs> what do you love most about your place? Hi, my garden. <laughs> I love the garden. And I guys, love the birds as well. She has the most perfect smile. God, like in Menyachin de Kechi. How do you say that in English? I don't know. But anyway. Let me break this. We won't forget. <laughs> oh, ah, we won't forget. So I'm going to end this video here because we have part two. I don't want to edit anything out of this video so you can see everything that I saw. And then we have part two. So let's meet there.